Okay guys, so um, I just wanted to make a quick video for anybody who is curious about how to use Pelgun oil when you buy it on your CO2 cartridges. Um, as I always emphasize in my videos, you should always use Pelgun oil on your CO2 cartridges and RS, RWS chamber oil um, on, on your guns, um, anything metal on metal. Um, I'm going to use the Colt today. Um, just to demonstrate this um, because it comes with its own uh, Allen key hidden inside of it. Uh, you just take off this front cover right here on the grip and then this part, this back side actually is the Allen key and then it fits right in there. Um, you unscrew it obviously as downward as possible so that the CO2 cartridge fits in. Um, always check just so you don't leak oil which way the CO2 cartridge fits so it goes in head first. Um, once you have that, you take your Pell gun oil. Looks like that. Comes in a small little white uh, tube. I would suggest getting something like a little tray just so you don't get oil anywhere. Um, and then what you do is you take your standard 12 gram CO2 cartridge. Um, you can find them on Amazon and you just simply apply one little drop you put the tiniest little pressure on it and some comes out like that very tiny and you lean up the pel gun oil upwards that way so no more leaks out um, then you just simply take your gun your air gun and you just put the CO2 capsule in and rotate, screw it in so that none leaks. There we go, got a nice grip on that. And that's it. That's how you apply Pell gun oil to your CO2 guns. I would suggest doing that with uh, every 12 gram CO2 cartridge that you use. You can find different answers on the internet if you look it up. Some people tell you do it every certain amount of shots or whatsoever. Um, I would suggest just using it every CO2 cartridge. Um, but yeah, that's all for today. So I just wanted to let you guys know how to use Pell gun oil in case you didn't um, or had any questions about it. Uh, so yeah. That's, this is Paul for Replica Gun Reviews. See you in the next video.